So guys, part three about if sex matters in long-term relations. I start reading, there's only two pages, but I start reading comments from the bottom. So we go to the top. Um, one of the comment is, following, I'm following with interest, the lady. Uh, I'm 52, my husband is 49. We had sex eight times last year, so in 2021, so it's like less less than one once a month. Yeah. It was all instigated by me. At 52, we haven't had sex since November, so it's now January. So. <laughs> My lovely wife. <laughs> what? Last year or the year <laughs> No, last year. <coughs> last year they had it for a, a the last year in 2021 they had it eight times. <laughs> <laughs> She's counted. Yeah, why would you count? Because for a woman it's important to be wanted, to be loved. To be appreciated, no, if she's got medium or high sex drive. <laughs> Why it's not like trying on a dress, medium or large. It is sex drive is high, medium or low. Or none. Or none, yeah, unfortunately. If for someone, it, if for someone... If it matters for somebody and the partner, the, the other half has got none, it becomes a problem, doesn't it? <laughs> Can you go away? I'm trying to drink. I'm not half of you women. So, so there is, there can, there can be com lovely compatibility and can be not, com no, la lack of compatibility. So we carry on. Nigel brings great male perspective in this story. He, he brings great <laughs> input. So, does she mark him out of ten as well? <laughs> of course, every woman marks, and men, everyone marks everybody, my lovely. Do you know, everyone marks everybody on everything. Does he get the gold star? No, yeah, if a man tries really well and a woman is happy, he, she, if they're both very happy then. And if they both... It sometimes it's just naturally the naturally compatible and naturally lovely lovely feeling, isn't it? But if they are not, then it's disappointment and they're trying to find the, the right person for them. Um, we carry on. So we we haven't had sex since November. He finds any excuse not to do it. We had a huge blowout last night. As we were in bed early, so I, <laughs> so I tried, but he was too tired. It can happen at 49. Yeah, he was half dead. <laughs> No, 49 is still young, my lovely, up to 85, and then you become middle-aged. Yeah, but he was too tired. I ended up crying with frustration. No, then she took it personally, like, but it's not, sometimes it's not her, you know, it's, it's just the situation. She cried with frustration. I have no idea where to go from here. I don't want s sex with anyone else. Everything else is in our relationship is almost perfect. He just ha has no sex drive. No sex drive. 
too tired, working too hard probably, too stressed with life, with traveling, with thinking about paying bills. It shouldn't be, it shouldn't be like that, you should be able to just relax, unwind, think about nothing, enjoy your day off, weekend off, rebond, re, um, feeling, feeling bond, well, feeling bond, feeling bond, um, reconnect, that's the word, should be able to reconnect with each other and not to stress about anything else, try to concentrate on each other, on, on the situation. Everything else in our relationship is almost perfect. So it's a good indication not to not to live. He just has no sex drive. I'm getting resentful and angry. M more so as each day passes. Yeah, in a not satisfied woman uh, can be really mm -hmm unhappy he always has an excuse previously it was that we drank too much now we've, we've reduced it dramatically or oh, drinking doesn't actually help drinking too much especially doesn't help better sex drive but you must reduce none or, or tiny bit because it, it does drop your sex drive drinking in big uh, quantities um, I'm getting resentful most of the, uh, he always uh, has an excuse mm -hmm. uh, reduce dramatically the excuse is that he's he's tired because he's on a course so he's studying and at 49 next week it will be because he is starting a new job he may as well say it's because there is why in the day of the week mm -hmm, letter why he is handsome and other women fancy him i feel like saying if only you knew you see that's that's exactly right sometimes you look at someone and thinking, oh, they're nice, but it, you might you might not know they completely go got low or no sex drive, and there would nothing would happen. Like there wouldn't be much happiness in that relations if it's important for you. So uh, the general visual picture is never an indication what the relationship would be like, and if you'd be happy in this situation. Another comment we've got. Um, I want to say, if you were really old, I would say it's probably one of those things. But you're still quite young. Definitely would bother me. Yeah, with age, as I say, say over 60, over 70, over 80, it's quite kind of expected nature-wise. Nature it wouldn't be like comparing... A 25 year old man sex drive and 60 and 60 70 and 80 year old man sex drive yeah so in this situation it's predictable you you expect this to happen but um, when people are young it's harder to cope when hormones uh, expectations i agree with that See you next part, my lovelies. Thank you for watching. Comment below.